St Ives, Spring 1990. It's Lester on the left with John Barnes. Lester and I had gone to St Ives to pick up some items from John's collection for the Magic Lanterns exhibition for the Magic Lantern Society at the Architectural Association in London and for Mommy in London. John's showing off a rare brass early film strip Magic Lantern from about 1890. This was used in our exhibition. It's one of only two examples known and we had both of them in the exhibition. And the lantern is covered with images from the Commedia dell'arte and also from early Phantasmagoria shows. As we can see here in these close-ups, we were mostly there to collect lantern slides which Lester and I selected from the very large collection which John and Bill owned and which is now in the Cinema Museum in Turin. John and Carmen's own museum had closed about four years before we made this particular visit. There's a nice early small Phantasmagoria lantern from mid 19th century. What's for lunch? Lester takes over the camera for this shot. And John always had new and interesting stories about old St Ives, which of course he had known since he was a boy in the 1930s. John and Carmen's home, overlooking the harbour, Kino House. John once said to me as we stood watching the tourists taking their holiday snap photographs, those poor people, he said, all their memories will fade as the colour dyes in their photographs disappear. And I said, oh, I don't think so, John. He was right and he was wrong. The colour bleaches away, the images disappear, but the memories, the memories don't fade.